The new program aimed at saving the lives of local firefighters. The Fairfax County Fire Department just got a grant to provide early cancer screenings to every member of the department. Yet yeah, CDC data shows firefighters have a 9% higher risk of getting cancer and a 14% higher chance of dying from it. News Force Amy Cho shares one firefighter's personal journey. Being a first responder means putting your life on the line to save others and oftentimes facing a higher cancer risk. Being in the fire service, you always hear cancer, but in my mind, I was always thinking way after retirement, not during my career. Barry Mayhem is a captain in the Fairfax County Fire Department. In 2021, they offered him a free cancer detection scan. He felt healthy, but the scan revealed an issue in his spleen, which turned out to be stage four colon cancer. I'm very thankful for the scan that was offered. We, we want to be healthy and be there with our kids and watch them grow. He ended up fighting cancer twice, but is doing better now and just returned to work a few weeks ago. Soon, all Fairfax County firefighters will get the same opportunity he did for a free cancer detection scan. Just stage four is, can be life-threatening and that's what we want to prevent. Battalion Chief Brian Edmonston was part of the team that applied for the funding from FEMA. All current firefighters and those who retired within the last five years will be eligible for the scans, which start in a few weeks. We're really excited, uh, really excited uh, as a whole to, to offer this to our firefighters coming across. And so you build really strong relationships with these folks. You're, you're working with them 24 hours a day. You're eating dinners with them and they, it becomes a second family. The Fairfax County Fire Department did a pilot program of the scans in 2022. Out of 176 firefighters, over half had abnormal results in areas such as testicular, cardiac, liver, and thyroid. And as they face the tough reality that more members could discover cancer soon, Barry Mayhem says he and his fellow survivors are ready to help. As soon as we find out somebody else is getting diagnosed, trying to be there for them and, you know, seeing what their family needs. We all want to live a long life and you know enjoy the retirement that we work for. A push to save lives for those who've given so much. In Fairfax, Amy Cho, News 4.